Hey, what's up everyone? In this video, we're gonna learn how to push and load snapshots in Go High Level. Now, if you're not familiar with what a snapshot is, it is basically a copy of one of your sub accounts, including all of these different assets. A good example of this would be, let's say you have a sub account loaded with all of those funnel templates, automations, all the stuff that you have invested a lot of time in, and you wanna replicate that to your other sub accounts or maybe your client's account, you can actually create a snapshot of it, and that will allow you to copy all of these assets across in a few seconds. Now, when it comes to snapshots, there's a couple of key features that you can use, which are really helpful, starting with load snapshot. Now, this is used when you already have created a snapshot and you want to carry over all those different assets to a new account or maybe your existing sub account. What you can do is easily load that in and it will automatically move all those assets in a few seconds. This is widely used by marketing agencies, especially when they're onboarding new clients and they want to preload their sub accounts with all of these amazing assets that they have put so much time in. Now, talking about push updates, let's Let's say you are a barbershop marketing agency, you have 30 or 40 accounts under your belt and you used one sub account to launch all of them. Now let's say you want to roll out a new funnel to all those 40 accounts. In this scenario, push update can really help you because instead of copying them one by one or maybe loading snapshots individually, what push updates allows you to do it, push a certain asset or a collection of assets to all the linked accounts at once. And this is widely used in the SaaS space because as you know, they want to have stickier clients. So they're trying to roll out new assets all the time and push updates feature can really help you accelerate that process. So let's dive into Go High Level and I'll show you how to use both of these features. So I'm in the agency view for my Go High Level account and as you can see that under my snapshots, I have a couple of snapshots that I've created off of my sub accounts. Now if you're just starting out, if you don't have any sub account with all those assets that you have personally worked on, feel free to use these snapshot templates by Go High Level. It has snapshots for various verticals and niches that you can use. Now let's talk about how do we load these snapshots into your client's accounts or your sub accounts. So the first thing you have to do is head over to sub accounts right here. Now, if you are launching a new client, of course, then you'll have to create add sub account here. And if you do decide to go that way, you can choose a snapshot from here. These are the pre-built snapshots by Go High Level. If you want to use your own, you can click here and then use those ones. And then you can fill out the information like address details and the owner details for the sub account. Another way to do this is let's say you already have a sub account existing in your Go High Level account and you don't want to create a new sub account just for the purpose of loading a snapshot. It is pretty easy. All you have to do is head over to that sub account, then click on manage client right here. Then click on the top right side where it says actions and then click on load snapshot. In the drop down, you can select the snapshot that you want to load, click on proceed, and then you can also select the assets that you want to push. It gives you the option to skip or select all of these. Once you are satisfied with these settings, click on proceed. It will check for conflicts, which is a pretty awesome feature in my opinion. And once you are certain that you're not overriding anything important, you can proceed. Of course, if it is overriding anything that it shouldn't be, you can actually skip that or you can choose to override if you wish. Once you're satisfied, scroll down, hit proceed, and then it will load that snapshot into your sub account in a few seconds. Now, going back to account snapshots, I want to talk about this push update feature. Now, let's say you have a new asset in your host sub account and you want to push that to all the linked accounts. The first thing you'll have to do is refresh your snapshot so that it has the latest copy available for all the accounts to use. And once that is done, you'll click on this arrow right here and then you will be able to see all the linked locations. If you want to skip any location from here, you can do that. Since I already have one for this example, I'm just going to select that and click proceed. And then again, you can select the assets that you want to push. I usually like to select the skip option first because it skips everything and then I can just go in and let's say I only want to roll out a new form that I've created which is this form for landing page right here. I'll only select that and it will actually show you that how many assets am I rolling out right now. It is just one. Everything here is zero. So I'm pretty certain that I'm not going to override anything. Still, when you hit proceed, it's going to check for conflicts. And if it finds that that asset already exists in the sub account where you're rolling this out, you can check that right here. And then you can wish to override that or skip that depending on your use case. Once you're done, click proceed and then it will roll out that asset to all the linked accounts that you select. Selected, and this will make your life so much easier, especially if you're rolling out new updates to a bunch of clients at once. All right, so that was all about it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and thank you for watching.